A local artist is volunteering his talent and time to beautify the community. His work in the neighborhood caught the attention of our ABC 10 News anchor Vanessa Van Hefty in a way that can only be positively San Diego. So we scrape these off. Chris Cott. So get the surface kind of smooth. Volunteers an hour a day. Basically how it works, something that small sprays on. <clears throat> Wipe it off. Removing eyesores like yeah. this. And hey, whatever I do, it's going to look better than this. He's a professional artist. I, I, I don't get it. So this really ticks him off more than most. Quit tagging. Obey. <laughs> Obey me. Dumb shot. <laughs> yeah, you are a dumb shot. <laughs> I agree. His goal is to beautify everything from rusty railings and utility boxes to large signs like this. I've had a little bit of extra spare time, and so when there's something like this, um, we love La Jolla. His paid job consists of murals for cars, restaurants, and bars, but the pandemic stalled all that. They just didn't have the funds. They didn't want know when they're going to open back up. So he uses his talent and time doing this for free. I would ask if you come to La Jolla to visit, don't bring your marker. His protege, Ukrainian Ira Cosmos, is equally as talented. Just look at her rolling work of art, her own personal zoo. And this is, it's a children's pool. Art is what brought her to the U.S., San Diego, her inspiration. I think if people will smile, it's what's what we need. She's volunteering to transform this utility box as her next project. It's this idea. I, I hope... Uh... Everybody will like it. The duo also teaches ex-gang members how to airbrush the right way. We do classes to teach people that want to do their art how to use the airbrush and not just not go to jail and deface the neighborhood, but make money. The best part, they say, is not about the money, but this. Art of all forms brings joy. It is, it's like they say, it takes a village, and we live in a, one of the best villages on the planet. Vanessa Van Hefty, ABC 10 News. Pretty nice village, yes. Chris asked people if you do spot graffiti that he missed, make sure to do your part and report it on the city's Get It Done app.